The youngest heart transplant recipient at St. Vincent Health that they've ever served. And today he's reunited with his doctors who helped save his life. Wish TV's Tim McNicholas joins us now. And Tim, man has a lot of heart, more ways than one. Yeah, that's right. He's a 16 year old from Noblesville. In a lot of ways, he's just like any other kid. You know, he loves video games, hanging out with his friends. He's also into military history. But what sets him apart from most is his fight over the past couple of years. Will Chance wasn't born with a sick heart. He went to the doctor a couple of years ago with stomach pain. They did a scan and learned his heart had enlarged. We don't really know why. Uh, maybe a virus. Cardiac surgeon Chris Salerno says the situation was life threatening. Doctors treated Will for several complications before installing a mechanical heart pump. When he walked around before, he had to carry batteries with him and a controller, and he had a power cord coming through the skin. The pump was designed to keep him alive until he could get a heart transplant. St. Vincent called the chances this past September to tell them they had a heart for Will. We love you. Salerno performed the surgery a few days later, and today the Chance family celebrates its success. But pre surgery, Will gave his family some words of encouragement. No matter where I wake up, it's going to be a good place. If I was to wake up here in the hospital with a new heart, that'd be good. Or if I'd wake up in heaven, I'd, that'd be good too. There are no words great enough to be say how thankful we are to the entire team. Will says he's happy to lose what he calls the extra luggage, and he's looking forward to this summer. Really just getting to uh, do stuff with my friends and be able to keep up with them more and, you know, do certain things that I wasn't able to do before, like go swimming. The Chance family says when the time is right, they'll reach out to the donor's family to say thank you. Because of them, I'm here today able to live a normal teenager life. So Will takes medication daily to keep his body from rejecting the heart, but as you can see, he is recovering. He may need another transplant. The average post-surgery survival is about 15 years. For now, he's just enjoying life with his new heart. I'm Tim McNicholas, Wish TV News 8.